welcome to another video. This is Marissa. Welcome to Life from Mars. This is going to be a really cool video. I'm really excited about this. I actually get questions about this all the time. So as some of you guys may know, I am going on three years vegan in just about two months. I've been doing this for a while and I absolutely love being vegan. There are multiple reasons that I do do it, which I think I'm gonna address in a later video, but this is just kind of one faction of what goes into my life as a vegan. Basically, being vegan means that you don't eat or consume any sort of animal products that includes meat, dairy, gelatin, you know, just anything really that's made from an animal. But most vegans also make lifestyle changes to avoid animal products in everything that they consume. So that might mean, you know, not buying leather or it might mean using cruelty-free makeup. So that is basically what I'm going to be talking about today. I'm going to tell you guys about all of my favorite vegan beauty products. So not just makeup, but also just different cosmetics, shampoo, what I use for my toothpaste, all these different things. And I really try to keep things as natural as possible a lot of the things that I use are organic or use organic or natural ingredients so I really highly recommend these things this is not sponsored this is what I actually really love what I actually really use it's really great to support companies that are cruelty free and that are not testing on animals not subjugating animals to unnecessary hardships or lives of torture it is actually so crazy thousands of animals are used every day in laboratories for cosmetic testing a lot of them get very sick, they get injuries, they get skin issues, just different things and it just really is not humane and it's not necessary, which can be clearly proven by all the brands that don't do that. So it's always better to know what brands are cruelty free, to know what brands are not exploiting animals so that you can support those companies instead. So. Without further ado, let's get started. So the first thing that I want to tell you guys about is a product that I've been using for a couple of years now. And this is basically what I use for my soap. This is Dr. Bronner's. Now you guys can kind of see, it is a Castile soap. It says on there, 18 in one. This is hemp lavender. They have a lot of different scents tea tree, there's peppermint, there's orange, just regular lavender, regular hemp. There are so many scents for you to choose from, so you can definitely pick one that fits you. And basically, you can use this soap for anything. I can use it to wash my dishes, I can use it to clean, I can use it to wash my body, I can use it to wash my hair. Basically, anything that you could use soap for, wash my clothes, and also it's extremely concentrated, so you can dilute it a lot, and it still has a lot of power, and it smells so good it's natural dr. Bronner's is honestly an amazing company and so I highly recommend this to people all the time for your soap dr. Bronner's dr. Bronner's is where it's at and I'll include links to all this below okay so you guys can check them out as well okay so the next thing I'm going to go on to is what I use for my shampoo well I actually got this sort of relatively recently I saw it at Costco and they were having a sale for the shampoo and the conditioner together it was only $12 and I'm just gonna show you guys so they're really big bottles and the brand is Avalon Organics. So I've used this brand before. They do use organic ingredients. It doesn't have GMOs, parabens, sulfates, any of that, very much chemical free. I actually love the shampoo. It works so well, the shampoo and the conditioner. This one in particular is the Biotin B Complex Thickening Shampoo. So basically it's supposed to give you thicker hair. As it says, not no GMOs, vegan, and biodegradable. So really this is an A plus product because you know that you're not harming the environment, that you're not causing harm to any other animals on earth. And also you're not causing harm to yourself because most cosmetics have a ton of chemicals, guys. And I'm gonna make a video about that at some point, but you really, really, really wanna make yourself aware of what are in your cosmetics because they can cause some serious damage in your body. So highly recommend the shampoo and conditioner. I will put a link, highly recommend. Next thing I'm gonna tell you guys about is my toothpaste. My toothpaste is actually also Dr. Bronner's and this toothpaste is no less amazing than all of the soap products. So it is fluoride free. Obviously a lot of people think that fluoride is good for your teeth, but honestly it's just not worth it because fluoride is just not really good to consume. And I can tell you that I've been not using fluoride for years and I've had perfectly good teeth. So this is a fluoride free toothpaste and it is also made out of 70% organic ingredients. Really, really good product. Again, you're supporting a good brand, Dr. Bronner's. 
this packaging is recyclable. These are the sorts of things that I personally look at when I'm going to be buying something because I want to be an educated consumer. I don't want to be paying all of these problematic companies to keep producing problematic products. I want to make sure that I'm supporting companies that are actually improving the world. So Dr. Bonner's toothpaste, really dope, lasts a really long time, and honestly, it tastes a lot better, I think, than other toothpaste. All right, so this is the next thing. This is what I use for my lotion or what I have been using for my lotion. So it's Nourish Organic and I'm gonna tell you right now, Nourish Organic makes a lot of different products and honestly, all of their products are so awesome. They also make this body butter that I am kind of addicted to and I don't have it right now, I just have the lotion. This is the Hydrating and Smoothing Body Lotion in Fresh Fig. You can see that it is USDA organic, so it is certified organic, 100% organic ingredients. It says on the back, chemical free, cruelty free, and concern free. So this is a really, really awesome quality, quality product. I would highly recommend this lotion and also the body butter. The body butter is seriously, it's just amazing. It's so soft and so hydrating. I am kind of obsessed. I wish I had it so that I could show you guys, but if you ever see it, it's a little pricey, but it is worth a splurge and it will last you a long time. So, get it, get it. <laughs> okay, so now I'm going to be moving into the makeup products. I obviously do use a lot of different products, but I'm just going to show you guys my favorite sort of standout products. I always make sure that if I'm buying makeup, it is cruelty free and that it is vegan. But these are probably my favorite products, and after trying different things, this is just what I have found to be my favorite of things that are not only vegan and cruelty free, but also just really high quality makeup that works really well, in my opinion. First, for my foundation, I use Tarte. So Tarte is actually all vegan. They're pretty good about not using as many harmful ingredients as some of the other major makeup brands. So I use the Tarte Amazonian Clay Full Coverage Foundation. It also has SPF 15 and they have a lot of different colors. So this is supposed to last 12 hours and honestly guys, it pretty much does last 12 hours. This is a really nice quality makeup. It goes on super smooth and you can really use anything to apply it. I've used foundation brushes, I've used beauty blender. You really can kind of use whatever you want to apply it and you still get that really nice satin finish. I don't know if you guys can see, I'm wearing it right now. It's just very, very smooth. Yeah, it is a satin finish and I just love it. Honestly, I love the Amazonian Clay Foundation. I've tried a couple of different things and sometimes I'll stop using it and then I always end up going back to the Tarte Amazonian Clay Foundation. So, highly recommend that one. Really, really good foundation. The next thing that I'm gonna be showing you guys is what I use for my eyebrows. I use the Anastasia Beverly Hills Dip Brow Pomade in Soft Brown. A lot of people use this product. I'm not gonna go too much into it, but Anastasia Beverly Hills is vegan, and I just love this brow pomade. It's probably not the most natural thing in the world, but it is vegan, and it is a super high quality product. Once again, it's a little bit pricey, but honestly it's worth it and it does last a long time so for sure recommend this for some awesome brows the Anastasia Beverly Hills brow pomade it's dope for sure but the next things I'm gonna be talking to you guys about are my eyeliner and my mascara so I'm gonna start with the eyeliner I get asked about my eyeliner all the time all the time all the time all the time I basically do my eyeliner every day and so I always have my signature little wing in right now I'm wearing green so you can't really see the black but I do my eyeliner pretty much every day and I've been doing it for years so if I get a lot of questions about what kind of eyeliner I use how I do it whatever and I will tell you having a good eyeliner with a good um, tip and quality product makes doing eyeliner so much easier by far my absolute standout favorite eyeliner for years has been the Stila Stay All Day Waterproof Liquid Eyeliner. This eyeliner is just so awesome, guys. I don't even know how to explain. It's just so a perfect eyeliner like very pigmented you can see I've been using this one for a while so maybe it doesn't look the best it's a felt tip but it is a fine tip and so it's bendable it's not super hard but it's not a paintbrush tip either it's sort of in between 
and it's very pigmented it is waterproof so it stays on this is not gonna smudge this is not gonna smear and with this eyeliner I am able to get super precise lines which is something that I aim for when I'm doing my eyeliner I really like to get very sharp precise lines and so this eyeliner does it for you Stella is a vegan brand once again probably maybe not the most natural thing in the world but it is an awesome eyeliner and it is by far my favorite I do recommend that you get the waterproof one because it is much more reliable as far as all they use this is the eyeliner that you want to get Stella amazing amazing I love this eyeliner okay now for mascara I actually just switched to this mascara my mom got it in the makeup box that she receives every month and she just didn't want it so she gave it to me and I'm gonna tell you guys I love this mascara already it is by Too Faced it's their better than sex mascara and it is a fucking bomb mascara okay sorry sorry I'm not cussing but it's it's a great mascara again this is a pretty well-known product I, I feel like a lot of people really like like this mascara I mean there's a reason it's called better than sex it's a really good mascara I'm gonna just show you guys the wand so that you can get like an idea sort of like curves out and then in and then back out it's not super long you can just kind of see what the brush looks like but this is a great mascara I don't know I've just never really had anything that really just stands out to me that I feel like really works well and I can put two coats of this and my eyelashes just look so good it is vegan and it is cruelty free. I would super recommend that you guys try this one out. It's awesome. I only have two more things that I want to show you guys real quick. So first of all, I want to tell you about my favorite vegan lipstick brand slash lip gloss. This is the Kat Von D Everlasting Liquid Lipstick. This is my absolute favorite, favorite, favorite lip product. So it comes in multiple different colors. Some of you guys may or may not know, but Kat Von D is actually vegan, so all of her products are vegan, and she actually does use fairly less chemicals than a lot of the other companies as well. So this is just one color that I have. I used to have so many colors, but I just, I love them so much that I always carry them around with me and I, I end up losing them. Another thing that I love about this specific line is that she has so many awesome colors. So this is just a classic nude, but she has an awesome red, there's purples, there's blues, there's all sorts of colors in this line and honestly they're beautiful and they stay in place they have a beautiful satin finish they're basically supposed to be everlasting I'm telling you it is not going anywhere some people joke that it could literally go through anything that you could basically do anything with your lips and that it would never smudge <laughs> and I don't know if that's quite true I feel like I've had experiences where it'll you know it eventually starts wearing off but you really can push it you can leave this on for hours and hours and hours for sure the entire day it will stay on and it will not go anywhere so this is another product that you don't have to use that much of and that it lasts a very long time it's about twenty dollars for each one so you know it's a little bit of an investment but it's definitely worth it this is absolutely one of my favorite vegan makeup products love the Kat Von D Everlasting Liquid Lipstick so the final product is actually the one that I started using most recently so it is actually glitter and it is biodegradable glitter so this is vegan but also just wanted to share this with you guys because it is biodegradable so this is actually made by squad gold beauty this is the rave edition so you guys can kind of see what the glitter looks like it's really shiny really pretty iridescent little circles basically and it's made out of aloe vera leaf so it is completely biodegradable for those of you guys who don't know, glitter is actually kind of a huge environmental hazard and I love glitter. I always incorporate glitter into my makeup and so as an environmentalist, as somebody who really cares about the planet, I really wanted to find some kind of alternative and then I found this glitter and it is my absolute favorite, guys. The amazing thing about this glitter is that when you take it off, if you flush it down the toilet or if you throw it in the trash, it's going to biodegrade. It's not going to go and sit in some other habitat for thousands of years. It's not going to go and pollute the oceans. It's not gonna go and pollute the land. If you're out and a piece comes off your face and it falls on the ground, it is not going to stay there for hundreds of years. It's not gonna create an environmental hazard. It is going to biodegrade. And so that is what I love about this glitter. And 
Guys, it is so pretty. Looks just as good as any of the other regular plastic glitters, but without all the environmental harm. So I highly, highly, highly recommend this glitter. Once again, it is the Squad Goals Beauty. This is the Rave Edition, but they do have multiple different styles of glitters in the biodegradable options. But make sure that you get the biodegradable glitter because not all of their glitters are biodegradable, so. Fair warning. All right, guys, so thank you so much for watching this video. I hope that you got some inspiration on maybe some new makeup that you can try, some good brands that you can try to support. I honestly love all these products. Like I said, these are products that I use every single day and products that I'm actually proud to use. A lot of obviously what happens in our world is ruled by money and so I always say that you vote with your wallet and when you are supporting companies that are doing good in this world, you are encouraging that goodness. You are encouraging them to continue using sustainable or ethical practices and you're also sending a message to the companies who aren't doing that. I'm not going to pay you to pollute the environment. I'm not going to pay you to harm animals. It's very important to know what's in your products and like I said, you are putting these products on your skin, on your body, and it can very easily be absorbed into your body and cause damage later down the line. So, you know, nobody wants that to happen. You can look amazing and fresh and fabulous and still have a clear conscience and know that you are not causing harm to yourself or anyone else around you. So, thank you guys so much for watching. I will put all of the links to all the products that I discussed in the description description below if you guys want to check any of them out. Feel free to leave a comment if you have any questions about any of these products or if you have a suggestion for maybe another video that you want seen about something else with veganism or something else with natural beauty. So thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure that you do subscribe. Click the little bell so that you can get notifications for when I do post new videos about all sorts of different things. Not just veganism, not just beauty. So make sure that you do tune in. Thank you guys so much for watching and have a beautiful rest of your day. Well, I was touching up, oh.